Hello again fellow realtors, Henry Schubel here from Remar Tech Tips and this month's tip is about the ubiquitous lockbox. Now all of us have seen a listing that says list or permission required and I pose a question. Does that text in the listing keep a showing agent from getting access to the property? Unfortunately the answer is no it doesn't. I can open up my e-key on my phone, key in my pen, go to the lockbox and take the key out. But the listing agent can go through the log for the uh, lockbox, look at who entered the property, and if you don't have permission, they could come after you, and it's a $500 fine for entering without permission. So here's the scenario. An agent showing a property goes to a listed property where the listing agent has enabled the lockbox with a CBS code. The showing agent didn't bother to call for permission, even though the listing says list of permission required. So they go and attempt to open up the lockbox, and presto, they're confronted with this embarrassing screen right here. Now let's take a look at how you program this and accomplish these goals. Okay, let's open up eKey Basic and go to your lockbox inventory. And I only have one lockbox in this demonstrator, so we would select this single box first. So here, notice CBS is not enabled, so we're just going to hit the edit button to enable it. Then as soon as you enable that, the text box opens up so that you can enter in your um, CBS code. Then just click on the box that says enter CBS code and you get this screen. Type in your code and hit save and you're back to this screen here and ready to program. Then as soon as you hit program, the eKey app will ask you to enter your shackle code. You enter that. The eKey will start communicating with the lockbox, and as soon as it's done programming, it'll let you know with a friendly little message, and you're done. And the program returns to the main screen, and you can see that the CBS code has been set. Okay, now let's see what happens when an unsuspecting agent comes up to a property and they didn't bother to call the listing agent to get permission or to get the CBS code. And now the agent's confronted with the embarrassing position of trying to show a property that they haven't gotten permission for, nor do they have the CPS code. And finally, let's see what it looks like what had the agent done things properly, contacted the listing agent and gotten both codes before going to the property. They would check off the CBS required button, enter both codes, and voila, out comes the key box. Okay, Realtors, I've showed you how to program your lockbox and explained another option for applying the CBS code. I hope you found this helpful, and we'll see you next time on Weimar Tech Tips.